Good evening. My name is Julie Gardner, and I am a senior at The Ohio State University studying human nutrition dietetics. It is truly my honor to share with you the great impact that St. Paul's Outreach has had on my life over the past few years. I grew up in a very strong Catholic family. We went to Mass every Sunday. We were involved, even involved in the charismatic prayer group when I was growing up. Um, but as I got older, I really started to question our faith and beliefs. Um, I went to a public school from kindergarten through high school, and I never had a very solid Catholic education. Um, and I also never had faithful friends. My friends were not interested in church or God. And so as I got into high school, I really started to get sucked into this culture of partying and drinking and having impure relationships. Um, and I continued to make these poor decisions as I got into college. I lived in the dorms and I was constantly surrounded by students abusing sex, drugs, and alcohol on a regular basis. It was extremely hard not to be influenced by them. These were the closest people I had to reach out to, and I wanted to make friends. Um, and so I slowly made decisions that pulled me further and further away from my faith in God. Luckily, at the time, um, my older brother was involved with SPO, and he diligently invited me to SPO events every week. But I was really apprehensive to come around at first because I didn't think that these people would want anything to do with me if they got to know the kind of life that I was living. But I had no idea that my initial judgment was so wrong until I got to know some of the amazing SPO women. They were so kind, warm, and welcoming, and they made me keep wanting to come back. Um, in the early winter of my freshman year, I started to hear about this retreat called the Fan Into Flame Retreat, and everyone in SPO was inviting me to come. At that point, I had reached a very low bottom in my life, and I knew that I couldn't go on living the way I had been. And so I decided to go on this retreat to get away for a weekend and try to figure out what made these SPO people so happy. This retreat was truly the turning point of my life. Um, I learned more about our Catholic faith than I ever had, and this led me to have an intense personal encounter with Jesus. Throughout the weekend, I had an amazing experience in our small group. The women in my group were just so loving and supportive, and they made me feel open to ask any questions and share my experiences. The leaders from my group were also an amazing example for me of what Catholic women look like who are my own age. On the first night of the retreat, we had the opportunity to receive the Sacrament of Reconciliation. And I hadn't received this sacrament in over a year. And after being absolved of my sins, I felt a definite weight lifted from my heart. And it just opened me up to praise God so much more fully and with joy on my heart. Um, the next night, we had an opportunity to be prayed over by our small groups. And um, I truly felt God's presence during our prayer. And I was just filled with so much joy and peace again. And by the end of the weekend, I felt more alive than I ever had in my life. And I didn't want to go because I knew back in the dorms it would be extremely hard to live out this newfound faith. And that's why I started to pray about living in household. I knew that in household I would be built up and supported every day by amazing people who were living their life for Christ. And it was really the best decision I've ever made to live in household. It has shaped my life to be focused on living for Christ and loving and serving those around me. Um, I have formed some amazing friendships with the women that I've lived with, and they call me on daily to dive deep into relationship with God. Um, I've really learned the great importance of having daily personal prayer, and I have seen many fruits of it manifested in my life by um, a deep personal relationship with Jesus. So an increased sense of peace and joy in my daily life and direction in all that I do. Over the years, I've had the opportunity to meet many people from around the country who are involved with SPO, and they have really set me on fire to be on mission. And I really hope to keep this mission with me throughout the entirety of my life.
to bring Catholic faith alive wherever I am as I move on into my career in dietetics and one day when I have my own family.